Art to me is just passion. My earliest memories really just revolve around art. It's like you take all your life experiences. It talks about my culture. This series is called Cultural Resilience, We Still Exist. And so what I did in this was I did portraits of friends and family, and then I did these Aztec symbols over their portraits to represent this invisible culture that we still walk around with. People see the art, feel the art, that feel like they're tied to it. This is Catalina and she is also the model of this painting here. This one is called Genetic Memory. I told him, your painting is amazing, Jay. Can you paint me? It does look like me. And upon the Cultural Arts Gallery is a accessible art space for community. Napantla is an Aztec word that means the space in between. That Napantla say is where we heal, we rejuvenate, and we create, and that's what we do in the space. White Center is constantly overlooked. It was important to me to have a space like this here. We're building community. That is what makes me happy. So we have the gallery wall that changes every month and focuses on marginalized communities. You're getting this mixture of veteran artists who have big names, but you're also getting people that it's their first time that they've ever displayed in a gallery. This is a painting by Barbara Rivera. This skateboard was painted by Angelina Villalobos. She's an amazing local artist. We have authors and poets that come in. We're able to do workshops. And then we also have a youth arts program. Everything is free and accessible to communities. We want to create that physical space that brings folks together, making sure that we put art in the hands of the people. You know, supporting White Center, supporting South King County in this area. Definitely a, a labor of love. We don't want to be the only cultural art space. I would love to see a bunch of spaces open up like this. Thank you.